So it looks like we need another badge or two in order to actually get, uh, <laughs> in order to get the good magic arts. We okay. Ah, no. So, hello and welcome to the last episode of Pokemon Epay. Pokemon French Sword. Right. Oh my gosh, that out levels me a fair bit, huh? Shoot, maybe I should have spent a bit of time grinding. Lame AI. We're oh, fine. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, our starter is a bit low level compared to both of these. We want you to be a Sylveon. And you still, you already love us, buddy. Well, at least you should. So what are you doing here about all of this? Ah, uh, manage. Wait, all of these look savage. Octo reprise. Like the rap or something? Curious. Oh wait, absorb. Toxic spikes. And like poison sting or whatevs. Wee. Yeah, as well as not making it into this one. We've been playing Pokemon Violet. Um, we did one session of it. We did like eight episodes. Uh, I'm not going to say how well that went or anything, so you can watch that for yourself once that uh, starts up in the new year. But I want you to at the very least finish up the gyms in this episode. If I also do uh, the Elite Four, that'd be nice. What is this? Cinnamon. Bite with the canines. Swift or bite? I think bite. We already have a uh, payday. Hi, Cinnamon. Hi. Mm. Evolve? No. Look, a big pearl. Unwhelma Savage appeared. It looks savage. Use some frail magic. Oh gosh. some decent levels here. Actually, I'm the one playing here, so do I want to change up the team somewhat? I like having the combo of these two. That works out well. Having the starter, that's supposed to evolve any level now. Having... Okay, so we have fire, we have grass, we have big old normal type, right? Because resume. 
yeah, horsepower, we have rest. Yeah, so this is just basically a stall tactic. So for gyms that don't have poisonous steel type, we can just toxic spikes and then go to rest strats. This is supposed to be fire and fighting because that's what all fire starters become. This Pokemon, I'm not sure of though. Let's see, what else do we have? Right, yeah, Batwing. What else did I put on the team because I wanted to? Garney Braid. Um, hmm. Still only eight boxes, huh? Am I missing, like, a bunch of plot stuff? I should have more than eight boxes by now. You end up with, like, 31. So go and have some fairy types going on here. Ice, grass, fire, fighting. What's our, like, ghost type? We should get a nice ghost type Pokemon to add to this. Maybe ghost psychic or something? There's some poison there. Okay, I need a nice ghost type. I could probably go and just catch a Ghastly. Ghastly or like a Litwick or something. A nice Haunter probably would be pretty useful. Yeah, that's not going to heal very much. Oh, you and your lame AI. Just trying to think. Just wondering if I even could catch a nice cell. Uh, Hydro pump? No, Aqua Wing. Yeah. <laughs> Elixir Max. I could go for that and teach it Toxic, Toxic Spikes, Baleful Recovery, and Recover. No, Baleful Recovery and Protect. No. Baleful Protection and Recover. I want you. That's not the Pokemon I went for. See, this time it didn't say it was, uh, like, Savage. So I think I just went, happened to find a bunch of high level Pokemon in, uh, in the water there. Which is weird. Ninety percent accuracy by hundred damage. That just does damage equal to like the difference. That's ground type, and then rest because healing. I think get rid of high horsepower, or no. Get rid of this. Because having a fighting type move is more um, coverage than having a normal type move. Normal isn't super effective against anything.
Yeah, I'm still, I'm so used to seeing, uh... Oh no, wait, I think God is super effective as poison. I'm still so used to seeing the shiny, uh, Toxapex. That I've, like, been using. That seems just like a normal one, it's so weird. Although I forget what the uh, shiny sprite looked like. Alright, use one of these moves. That's not supposed to be that effective. I think it just tried to poison me, but it failed! Okay, it's strictly speaking water poison, because I remember when I joined that one group, that was all about, hey, let's use, uh... Gosh, I want to transfer all of these Pokeballs back on over to, like, my main, uh, shield save file. But yeah, so, uh... What was I saying? Something, something. Gosh, I played. Yeah, the one. As a, because I had uh, joined up with the group to do a little run of, hey, let's pretend we're kind of like gym leaders and we all have like one type of Pokemon each. Let's all choose a type, uh, not tell anybody, so nobody tries to get a comparative advantage over someone else specifically. And then let's all like, you know. Make our teams and battle against each other and stuff. But all of your Pokemon have to have like a one type in common. And I had a... I have no idea what all that text was about and I'm kind of concerned. Wait a second, wait a second. I need to look this up now. Okay, okay. So Toxapex, Balsam, Marini. Poison Barb. Oh, that's cute. Alright, so it already has a uh, resume of the Pokemon. It already has Toxic Spikes. Is this supposed to be Toxic? Okay, wait, wait. From level up alone. Oh, cool, it's in Gen 9. That's nice. Okay, level up alone, Mirani, Gen 8, it can have Toxic Spikes, Venom Drench, and level... F okay, so yeah, this would be Venom Drench, Liquidation, Toxic Spikes, and Pin Missile. So I need to uh, make it relearn, recover. Um... And they can also let it learn Toxic level 50. Where's its baleful recovery? It's about to also evolve into Toxapex, so that's also a thing to look out for. Oh, that's red. The shiny is red. Which is Toxic at a few levels higher. 
Lord from evolution that learns Baleful Bunker. So I say, let it get the eight levels, learn Toxic, and then evolve, learn Baleful. Make it relearn, um, that whatever stuff. And we worth the odds, I'll find a Goldeen with a Lightning Rod. Just lying around here, right? Oh no, uh, we can't attend the gym challenge because the town's all locked up. And Miani's like, hey, come over this way. Why does it look savage? It's ice, right? So fighting should be good. Cool. Anyway, I'm using ground type move. Ow! Good. I wonder why, like, new moves are in, uh, Gen 9. I'm sure I'll learn it eventually. 48 new moves. And 31 new abilities! Uh, something about confusion and attack. Hold on. Wait, hold on. Miani. Learning. A normal type? Oh no, this is Snowbaba. Okay, right. Why do you think it was... I'm Yanni. I'll let you into the town. I've already showed you the entrance and everything. But I have to know that you're good enough. Oh no, it's been tormented.
person I can't use the same move twice in a row now? I don't know what's going on. Do I ever do I ever look like the sort of person who knows what's going on? Nope, still no new magic spoilers. I mean the next hit comes out in like February, so that is not much of a surprise. Quanti saves them on light Pokemon. I think I'm good. I'm just looking. There is a 999.9 kilogram Pokemon that can learn Heavy Slam. So there's what? 75 Pokemon in all of Pokemon who will take less than the max uh, base damage from Heavy Slam if used by. Uh... Shoot, what's the Pokemon? Celesteela. Muppet Go! Yeah, it looks like Snorlax is not in Gen 9. I will bet. Ripple stick! Which I'm pretty sure it's the same name because Ripple stick is a French word. Oh, let's see, a user speed button. Press then smashings. Wait a second. I need an Allen key for something, but I was wondering. So I thought I saw an Allen key like in this one little cupboard over here. Which I apparently not. Okay, now's not the time for it. Looking forward for using it, but if I can find an Allen key, good. If I can't, well, that's unfortunate.
Let's go against Dark type Pokemon again. Uh, Bug, Fairy, and Fighting. a fighting type of one, right? I think this is a chance to make them flinch. I wish I had a thing to boost fine type moves. Scar, okay. Hold it clear! Uh. Shoot, what is this, a muscle band? Boost the power of physical boost by 10%. You know what? Sure. That's easy. Oh gosh, I think the work that's going on outside can be uh, very loudly picked up through my microphone. My window is closed and it's still this loud. Verbal married. Oh, good. It stopped, at least for now. Double pied. See, all you really needed was three kicks. How did I already go from almost about to level up to still almost about to level up? Like, with 800 experience, you got, like, none of it. <laughs> Super potion. Yep. 
Yeah, I don't want to talk about Gen 9 here. Who knows, maybe after I'm done with this uh, video, I'll go and uh, play some more Gen 9 just for the sake of uh, doing a bit of grinding. Yeah, just give our Pokemon another couple of levels. Pokemon love levels after all. Oh my gosh. That's super effective. It uh, yeah, boost my attack. So all I have to do is hit you one more time. Hit the Pokemon. Woo! <laughs> and then it missed. Oh gosh, yeah. Was it confuse it, paralyze it, charm it? And it's like, it wants to attack. Par paralysis check. Yep. Confusion check. Yep. Charmed check. No, it failed. This isn't the fully evolved form of our starter, right? I'm pretty sure. No, Cinnamon, don't learn photocopy. Uh, no, don't evolve. I will say in Gen 9 on the evolution screen, uh, Pokemon goes to evolve. Uh, it won't, like, not evolve. Until it's just about at the point of evolution. And then I'd be like, oh, it did. Because on my uh, personal playthrough of Gen 9, I want to, for some reason, keep the starter as its baby form all game. I don't know why. I should probably just let it evolve, honestly, get that power boost. I want to eventually get, you know, all of the Pokemon. I'm sure if I do wind up doing some challenge runs here and there, yeah, I think my first couple of challenge runs through it are going to be with uh, Pokemon from Gen 8 and before. Yeah, I have a whole system set up where I breed Pokemon to try to get Pokemon with perfect stats. You know, was it perfect IVs or what they're born with? Give them perfect EVs. So perfect IVs, perfect EVs. And then also give them the perf yeah, the best moveset that I can give them as a starting Pokemon. <laughs> Double battle time! I know I was trying to say something. Right, right, right. So yeah, I have a whole thing set up where I'm trying to be yeah, perfect static shiny Pokemon and going through this run to try to get a French Ditto with uh, perfect IVs is part of the challenge. The issue is that Dittos can't be bred. If Dittos could be bred, I would have just, you know, started up this, 
give my, you know, five perfect IVs, ditto, to this game. Uh, combine that with another ditto with some other decent, you know. So I already have a ditto, a Spanish ditto with five perfect IVs. Five perfect stats. Just after you combine that with, you know, another ditto with good stats. Bring them into here, breed out a whole bunch of dittos. Of course, a new save file can't see the uh, base stats. I guess the most I could do is just check the number. I think I could check the numbers of the stats as it takes six to level one. And if they look like they're in the spot to be the best stats, send them into Pokemon Home, send them back into the Pokemon Sword Rise being Pokemon. And just check it again. And just check all of them. See what it takes. If I find a ditto with more perfect stats than other ones that I've been that I was using, throw that one in place instead. So yeah, yeah, po yeah, but unfortunately dittos can't be bred, so. Honestly, my other choice uh, was to try to get some, yeah, like a French version of like Pokemon, you know, uh, red, blue, yellow, gold, silver, or probably crystal, and do the whole thing like that I did with my Gen 2 Pokemon. Well, actually, yeah, yeah. Get like a French version of Pokemon Crystal. Uh, use PK hacks to get a, you know, perfect statted ditto on there. Right? Don't. I don't know if you can use PK hacks to change the gender of Pokemon. Not gender. No, the uh, language of Pokemon. And I don't know if like language tags would exist way back then. And I can't seem, so I guess I, I could try uh, do it with Gen Six. To try to uh, alter my save, PK hex it, get a perfectly started non-English ditto in there, or you know, do one quick run through of Pokemon Sword in French. So yeah, one quick run through of this. There is a raid den where you uh, can be able to find dittos. So all I have to do is get one of the legendaries, like say, get that big old sword legendary Pokemon. Yeah. Slot up the raid, toss that into a start fighting. Take down a ditto. And hope that I happen to get one with perfect stats. If the stats don't look good enough, then just like keep trying. Hi. 
you been poisoned, you know? Hope you don't have any poison dark types on your team, or else those po those toxic spikes are not going to be helpful. Unfortunately, I never gave uh, Mirani recover back. And since I didn't let it evolve, it doesn't know fatal uh, protection, protection, whatever that you know attack is. Reprise these. For a breach. Yeah, be poisoned. Fuck him, so not a poison type now. I don't know what that Pokemon even is. John Day Station! Yay, get toxic! Level 45, oof. Oh, right, probably, maybe could have sent this out earlier. Sean should do it. Honestly, it probably just wants to start using uh, recover strats. Alright. Out comes Cinnamon. Cinnamon, force! Hi, Cinnamon. Did some damage and the toxic took some damage. Oh no, still has two more Pokemon beyond this. Toxic should take it out. Come on. Reposition. I outsped. That's a pretty bad sign. Oh, I think it's a move where it's like only moves like if I if I had attacked, and since I didn't attack, it couldn't hurt me. Well, that's one turn down.
There we go. Oh, gosh. Oh, hey. That, oh, no more hail. Two turns down. Okay, still asleep. We should be fine. Three turns down. Just don't crit. Yep, but nope. Okay. Because it crit, we lose. Okay, wait, wait. Um, Yarny. Random Drench. Attack, special attack, and speed stats fall. Poison targets by one stage. So, poisoned, the move will fail. So now it knows to be cafe. Okay, so there. And then I can start working on those things. Hey, you have to be in uniform. Oh, right, shoot. Okay. Hey, have fun. And like storm the castle and junk. I can't use my motorcycle. I'm in a gym challenge. <sighs> Bye. Um, why the board's not showing up? Like at all? Ah, oh, there's some words. And from the face again, that crit was a lucky shot and you know it. I'm gonna beat you better now. Huh, sorry, yeah. I woke up recently. There's not much to really say, right? I got the... Oh, gosh. Yeah, you got out the toxic spikes. That's all you can really have hope for, right? Do not get the poison point going on here. 
So I have to switch on over to Pilebot. Even know if the like if the master bait C method still works in Gen 9. Oh, hey, that's nice. I think I'll be fine. Thing popped in front of my face. Four hundred Pokemon. Oof. Yeah, the Masuda method. For each of my different language origins, it will increase the shine chance of the eggs that are produced. So if you breed two Pokemon with the same language origin, the odds will mean at 1 in 4096. That's assuming you have the shiny charm. For breed two Pokemon with different language origins, one is English and one is Japanese, for example, it will increase to 1 in 682. Oh, wait. The stacks of Shiny Charm increase the chance from 1 in 682 to... One, oh, no. 1 in 512 with the Shiny Charm. So the Masuda method is the more important one to go for. What? Wait, I've been Shiny Pokemon for years. So you have to set up a picnic with two compatible Pokemon and simply walk around away in the picnic area and eventually may go up here. Just want to make some epic possible food and just bring the two Pokemon you want to the picnic. So much could be customized for a whole bevy of different bonuses and boons, such as extra experience. Tends to find specific types of Pokemon and more. Sparkling Pride. Read a sandwich and spark Pride effect. Specifically, the Herba Mystica ingredients. Woohoo! When you defeat 30 plus the Outbreak Pokemon, showing your odds increase. Oh gosh, 60 plus them. Oof, nice. 
So if, yeah, even if I don't attack, I still only have to wait like five turns. That's ridiculous, how dare you. Okay, so apparently you can't utilize sandwich or any other methods to stack with breeding, just the shiny charm, so. Still 1 in 512. <laughs> uh, the best odds. And so, like, last I said, I already have a full and ditto with a lot of perfect stats. I'm just doing this because I'm greedy and I want all of the stats to be perfect. And you can't change the base stats of the Pokemon. You can't change the base stats of the Pokemon after it has been hatched, uh, except in a way that does not affect its breeding potential. Yeah, hyper training that ditto would not, you know, let its uh, offspring suddenly be said to have perfect stats. Oh, hey, look, a poison type. Haha. -ha. Toxic me again, coward. I'm just gonna help. Yay! I got this. Final boom! Deal a bit of damage. Or think they are the both one. Either way. You still have to wait a little bit. So, in the yeah, I want to explore the entire game world uh, in the playthrough that I have going on with Azura, and then in my personal playthrough, I want to go and try to uh, fill out the Pokédex as much as I possibly can. But all of, like, the new stuff that I find, I want to do, you know, in the recording. I want to do it with Azura. And then just playing through on my own, just going, I'll just, yeah, just go run around in circles and stuff. Fill out the Pokedex and all that.
Ajaba. Our Pokemon has that. Alright, cool. Everything got all up. Seriously, when does Cinderace evolve? Oh no, this is the final evolution. Oh, oh, right, right, right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, then. Yeah, that's okay. So that thing still needs six more levels. Don't know how much this needs. This needs to be more friendly. If you play a max raid den solo mode, then the Pokemon are guaranteed to be caught. That's why I was that's why I've been seeing things that people are saying it's like, oh yeah, when you go to you know, raid den catch a Pokemon and it fails, blah blah blah. It's like it's it never failed for me. Because for me it was a guaranteed capture. Yeah, just use Nitro Charge. You'll be fine. If I could get a Hone Edge, actually, that is a ghost type. That would be nice.
Only four max like these are guaranteed. Why can't we breathe it out? That's right, if we get uh, terror. Oh shoot, I think all of this would be uh, super f Lewis. So, what I'm hearing here is I might need to go and actually just play through all of uh, Gen 9 in French. Gosh, I'm not doing that right now. We. Okay, wait a second. So I'm looking up other stuff. Boom, boom, boom. Plot stuff. Okay, okay. So it looks like, yeah. So the terror... Yeah, whatever. The special raids in Gen 9 go up to 6 star, 
which guarantees five perfect IVs, so I just have to... Oh, gosh. If I want... Yeah, I think this whole run is probably actually just superfluous, but it's too late to not upload the episode, so... Whoopsies. But oh well, whatever. Starting, like, tomorrow. So much tomorrow, I'll be up uploading some uh, Pokemon violins. Are you ready to fight? Yes! Then change your clothes, kid. Just do a couple of battles. A couple of double battles, specifically. This is a dragon type gym. But we here focus on double battles. Double dragon. How great it's raining. I know that's a bird. Tailwind. Boost their side speed. I should have worked together to take down my Pokemon. Not very effective. Loud tackle! Good, you got rid of one of your Pokemon. Um. So, yeah. So, my plans are Gen 9 have, you know, a playthrough where I do my normal whatever stuff. I have a playthrough where I do my normal line of stuff, as I do. And then start just breeding in Pokemons. Try to get, you know, a bunch of perfect statted Pokemons. And preferably shiny Pokemons, because that's the shiny Pokemons are cool. And get those in as well. Yeah, and do uh but and jump on the train of solo Pokemon challenges. Yeah, I know. Super late to the party, but whatever. But whatevs. 
for uh, Gen 9. A lot of Pokemon sure look interesting, so might as well go through with them, right? I'd ever uploaded a playthrough of Gen 8, so here, but like it's in French. So, uh, Cecilia, have fun. OXO. So, we are given the chance to heal up and stuff, but... Fire types. So I think the last was water types, now it's fire types. And I guess the next would be grass types. No cinnamon, no. Oh, well, Wisp. <sighs> no, I did not get much sleep last night. I was up till like 6 or 7 a.m. and I woke up at like 11. I feel like I'm probably just going to end this gym, you know, finish this gym, and then just go and have a nice nap. Oh, both of our Pokemon are burned. Fortunately, we have lots and lots of burn heals ready to go, so that's not much of an issue. It's nice having a semi-daily series ready to go where I don't necessarily have to worry about it so much. Wait, hold on. Marin Marini? Jenny learns that. Poison jab, no. That's oh, right, press will get rid of burn. Boom, we got burn. 
destroyed. 65 health? Alright, that only affects poison targets, huh? Very little damage. Very much damage. You are still asleep. Oh, harsh sunlight was on, huh? Was it? I don't know. <laughs> well, you really tried. The jackpot! Ooh, I did more damage than the water move. Jeffers. Well, that kitty should gain extra faction points, huh? No. Still no. Still no. <sighs> what level is it? 45. I still need five more levels for it. Yeah, 1100, not very much, huh? I should give that was to Cinema instead. Alright, right. Revive you. Revive you. Keep both of you just in the party and let you get some experience levels. Right, grass types, grass types. Oh uh, shoot, what is good again? Grass types? I'm totally blanking here. I know fire. What else is good against grass?
Bug, Fire, Flying, Ice, Poison. I don't have any of those. Here, not very effective, but still did decent damage. Ouch. Alright, we definitely need to get rid of that one on the left. Oh, wait. Is that thing also ice grass? In terror resting. Real magic! Yay, it fainted! Because you got it correct, probably. Honestly, a fire type move would just destroy that thing. Four times effective because it's grass and ice. Are these things? No. See, here's the thing. It looks like both of these are about to faint. Well, okay, I guess not. Also, how did it outspeed? I guess that move has priority or something. Reposition! Sleep, 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 sleep. Okay, dragon type, dragon type, dragon type. Dragon type takes extra, yep, yeah, from dragon, very nice. I need those ones. Just hoping there is another. Oh, 
Anti para, anti brulee, total sign, hyper potion. I guess I don't have anti sleep. Okay, how do I want to do this? Because Dragon Fairy and Ice type moves. But I think I have one Fairy type move and like two Ice type moves, and that's it. So I guess, yeah, lay out the Toxic Spikes. So as we don't use any Electric, Fire, Grass, or Water moves. Yeah, Dragons resist all of the starter types Fire, Grass, Water, and also Electric, because Pikachu. And the only super effective. Against dragons? Wow. Well, we had a fairy type to just negate some of these dragon type moves, you know? I mean, not much. Okay, I see both teams are going for rather similar strategies. Did I even get out both toxic spikes? I sure hope so. Pointed stones, yes. Abatage. Looks like they both got a lower stat. That was a crit. Ouch. Alright, there's another one. Alrighty. 
big splash. That should be super not very much. Oh gosh. Well, you're gonna be taken out, but let's take you out first. Now the main issue is Snorlax is about to paint. But hey, it still got a heck of a lot of XP before it did. <laughs> uh, belly drum. Raises its attack stat up to maximum, but halves its, uh, but it takes half of its max HP and damage. Not yet. Lower its HP by half. Unfortunately, can't go the other way around to keep it from thinking. Can't use the leftovers before uh, dealing with the dust. Alright! No more time for a Dorado Sandstorm. He's so impressed because I changed the weather too. Well then! Yeah, see why you want to get rid of the ice type immediately, huh? That was a crit. And now we're right back on the sand. Yeah, that's why I like level 46. That's pretty good. Items. Boom, 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 boom. Super potion time. Fair chunk of damage, ouch. Lowered some stats. Shrelder of Force. Okay, Super Potion didn't matter, it seems. Yep. Alrighty. Run, recover before you get attacked again. Or just don't. Okay, never mind. Well, I guess it's time.
Green. Time to hope and pray. Why? Oh no, the, okay, okay. That Pokemon got replaced. A Steel type, so I think it's fine. Then you're gonna down to max, beat me, and whatever. Well, neither of the Pokemon are poison, so that's a pretty bad sign. Oh well. I mean, sure, if I grind up a little bit to get Mirani up to level 50, let it learn Toxic, then let it evolve. That might be a good idea. I don't think Honage appears 
Spear in the eyes. Although... Rock is the only type that's yet to be paired with ghost. So there is a normal ghost type now? Curious, curious, curious. Oh, interesting. This turn the wrong place or well, apparently Legends Arceus introduced a uh, normal ghost. So I mean I have to play through Legends Arceus just to get that, just to actually fill up Pokedex stuff? Ugh. Now that would be annoying. Wait, where's all these ice types I was looking for? You there, Betty. Oh look, the flappy fish.
<gasps> A sword! I still prefer the red blade of it. Um, hmm. <laughs> Monor payout. What? Can't get rid of this. Now I have to teach it flash cannon. Just gotta keep fighting, you know? With the swift being on level 28, it's gonna take a while to uh, level up, huh? Oh well. Yeah, I probably should just do some off-camera grinding, just to, uh, not have this be so dull, and then just head right back to the gym, so. I guess I'll be back. Okay, let's try again. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I could do the whole Darkest Day thing, but I'm bleeding again. But I feel like it's probably a miss. Okay, okay. I leveled up my team a little bit in the last, you know, second. I just want to finish the gym. If I can finish the gym, then I can call it there and probably play the file a little bit more just for the sake of getting, um, you know, getting the legendaries and stuff. But I don't really want to go through all the effort of doing all of the, you know, last of the game content now. I'll beat the gym. Beat the gym, we can call it. 
Maybe eventually I'll come back and do Darkest Days uh, videos, just a one-off, just to upload on a Friday or something, but for now it's just this. So I'm probably going to be doing a heck of a lot more Pokemon Violet uh, tonight again. Toxic that thing. All of its moves are super effective against the uh, guy gullet. What is this your own speed? Yeah, just fight the guy gullet for you. That's not the worst that I've seen. And if you can do one more of that to that, then I don't have to toxic the uh, Gigalith either. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't really need uh, toxic spikes out, because only one more of your Pokemon can even be poisoned. So either do two toxic spikes now, or just work on like protecting myself. And yeah, if I could find a black sledge to put on the Predasterai. Uh, on the Toxapex here, that'd be great. Let's do a Blockhouse. Another Cavalcade. It's like Protect, but if they hit me, then they might get poisoned. You just keep poisoning yourself, okay? You recover. You try to kill this here, Gigalith. Your toss specs is pretty fast for a Pokemon who doesn't actually have to attack. Good, that's right. Storm Axe still outspeeds the Gigalith. Woohoo! I got that Eevee up to three hearts of. Up to like three hearts of like friendliness and stuff. But apparently that is not enough. I have an idea, and the idea is to do that. <coughs> You're probably going to go down. Just quickly protect yourself again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Protect yourself from one and a half attacks. I guess. Okay, and apparently Snorlax got too paralyzed to do anything. So, um. Uh. And yeah. Toxic, knock you down a bit more. Oh no, it saved it from 
Okay, back. Half the backwards attack. No, 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 no. Okay, good. Toxic! I mean, to be fair, the music in these Pokemon games is high music. Gen 9 music is cute, though. Save me, save me, save me, save me, save me! Rest. If I can make it for a rest, indeed. <laughs> Blockhouse! Ha! That's understandable. I get it, I get it. But you've been poisoned, yo! One more Pokemon out, but the new Pokemon can't actually be poisoned, so all I really have to do is throw out something. I'll throw out Pyro Butt. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah, throw out Pyro Butt. Dura Lagoon. I just have to use recover with my Toxapex and just hope that it doesn't get attacked. Oh, that's right. It's, uh, isn't it like Dragon Steel? So it resists fire. It does not, however, resist fighting. I mean, that definitely took some damage, right? Alright. Smack on the uh, pile butt. That's good. And he kicked up a windstorm. Notice how pile butt is still just standing there just fine. It's power, but it also uses fighting moves. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, you're gonna die soon. I don't know what moves it has. Do I Dynamax the sword? I think I Dynamax the Eevee when the time comes for it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. If we kill off the Dunaconda, that'd be useful. Yeah, that definitely goes first. Almost kills it off. Go ahead. And I just have to hope that the sword goes before the snake. 
I don't think it will, though. So it won't actually matter. I might as well just attack the building with the sword. I'm fine. Attack the sword and it won't matter? Attack the sword, it didn't matter. And your Dynamax is over now, right? That was three turns, right? Haha, you -ha, lost a snake. Alright, let's do this thing! Here comes Cinnamon, here comes Cinnamon on a little cinnamon roll. I wonder how my cat feels when I do random singing about cinnamon. Oh, that's right, that's baby doll eyes. I mean, if you don't attack Rasputin, then Rasputin's gonna be fine. I don't think that the I don't think that it can attack both of our Pokemon, which means you either try to take out the Eevee or try to take out the Rasputin. How cute! Perfective, but did heal. Three hit points. Now. I wish I'd gone for the guard. But either way. Sinistro Max! Very little damage. Yeah, I should have just guarded for that and hoped that it went for the Eevee. Sinister Max and a hope. Fail magic. Boom, 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 boom. No. Shoot. Oh shoot, now I'm down to one Pokemon. I can't do like two revives. But you're also down to only one Pokemon. Die! No. I literally have to use revives or healing items right. No, no, no. I don't necessarily have to. I got this. Maximum guard is the game lagging. God, you max! You try, you failed. I go down to four hit points. Oh no, I undynamax first and then Sandstorm. If this is enough to faint, then oh no. Nope, nope, that's done. Okay. I'll go back to my bag. Not you. You did a decent amount of damage. I think that you would actually be able to not get killed. Yeah, I should have got a max during the first turn and then started just attack attacking. Whoa. Snorlax, though. Good Pokemon. All you have to do is survive this attack. You can do- I- no. Alright, well, I guess let's just try it again immediately. Let's try this again immediately!
You have to watch the Pokemon getting healed. It's like, yeah, this is where you failed. Actually, I think that for my team... Do it like that. So these two come out. Start all the poison stuff. If I knew where to get the black sludge, I would get the black sludge. To start healing Toxapex. Actually, that's a good question. Where do I get the black sludge? Black sludge can be found... Acquisition in here. Crabomatic poison. Oh no, sword and shield wind on. Okay, okay. Oh no, I don't have wind on yet. I think, right? No. I don't have it, right? Wind. Oh, right, it's win score because this is French. Yeah, I don't have access to that yet, so I could go and try the Cramomatic and hope for that, and, but that would require doing, like, you know, some DLC stuff to get that working. I don't think I get extra leftovers. Just want to beat this gym and then get done with this and I don't have an idea what I want to do after this, but that's what I want to do. Oh god, yeah. These long videos take like four flippin' ever to upload, so I'm gonna be glad to go back down to one hour videos. Even just even if it's a speed up episode. An hour-long video takes like maybe two or three hours to upload. This has been uploading like all day. <laughs> the last episode, episode four. Episode five? Wait. Yeah, episode five has been uploading like all day. Honestly, I should have insisted on doing another episode of this before Christmas. Toxic on that one up there. An attack. Double kick on the Gigalith. So if I can try to manually kill that thing without it being toxic, that's useful. Oh, yeah, that. Yeah, great. A pointy clear! Yeah, my name shows up a lot in French. It's awesome. <laughs> Protect myself. Yeah, I think when I'm done with this, I'll go play some Pokemon Scarlet on my handheld and continue trying to, you know, evolve Pokemon and fill out a Pokedex. 
Fell out a full scarlet violet. Shut up! No. Oh, whatever. He's gonna faint to the sand anyway. Ra 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 ta 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 Okay, okay. You need to recover. Okay, that's just a little bit of damage. That's not like a ton of damage. Yum, 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 yum. Heal all the way back up to full. Let's do it. Okay. That's not that much. Woo! Healing! From 35 to like. Oh, no, 98. 63 health? That's cool. I have my moves. Protect yourself again. No. <laughs> just keep, just keep going. Just no, 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 no. Ha! You tried. Good. That was enough to faint it. It would have been annoying if that had stayed at like one. Woo, Simon leveled up. Okay, okay. I think you just protected, right? So, toxic this new thing. And you do that to it. A badage, a little bit of damage to both. That's fine. That's fine. I'll accept it. Don't even really need that toxic there, huh? Okay. Sandstorm is now gone. For now. You took a whole bunch. And you're taking a little bit. You're going to protect yourself. And you're going to absorb off of that. Protect myself! <laughs> protection strats, protection strats, protection strats! I don't want to get hurt, so let's maximize our defense! Oh god, yeah. I've been thinking lately about a post that someone made about, like, microscopic Pokemon and the, like, Pokemon blood and Pokemon bone. Where you go inside a body and you find, like, all sorts of new Pokemon. And, like, hey, that would be, like, you know, like, in Generation 5 that has, like, no reused Pokemon. It's, like, yeah, Gen 1 and Gen 5 are apparently the only gens that only had their own Pokemon. Uh, no Pokemon from early generations. Gen 1 because it was the first, and Gen 5 because it did the whatever thing. It's like, yeah, that would be really interesting. Except, even in a uh, Pokemon game set inside a body and using microscopic Pokemon, they could still throw in Pikachu! pikachu in. That's a thing! Oh, 
Or Pikachu in? However it's pronounced. They could still just have a Pikachu. The idea of like playing Pokemon, you can definitely have lots of strategies. Like, hey, I'm just going to, you know, poison all their Pokemon and then just keep switching. I can just like keep switching between like two Pokemon that are unaffected by their individual moves. Dead? No, not dead. Wow, you tanked that like a boss! You took like 30 damage from a Gigantamax Pokemon's move. Yeah, level 51, so... Gosh. Although I do kind of want to... Recover again. You know what? I'll do recover again this time. I'm trying to recover just... A couple of hit points. Not very worth it. That's fine. That's fine! I'm pretty sure that the sandstorm is going to finish it off, or, but still. And cool! Cover back up to full. You take some damage, you get KO'd. You know, see what? Let's send out the EVA! <laughs> Let's send it out! Meow meow! Wait, no. Both of them are going to protect themselves. <laughs> if they... Yeah. This is its third... This is third turn... Of Dynamax. I should double check if this particular Eevee can... Evolve. If it can't, then that would be really problematic to the uh, effect of trying to get a Sylvian. So the damage still went through? That shouldn't happen. Okay, now it's just a little Pokemon. That's not much damage. Although apparently I lowered a stat or something. I can't tell. I don't know. I, I, I don't know what's going on. What's going on? What's doing? them are guarding. Ha! Actually, what? Is that move that's been trying to use? Oh, uh, Dralodon. Dralodon. 
Try it on. Yeah, that looks right, right? What are its potential moves? Trying to do some sort of a jump on thing. So level 48, so Dragon Claw, Laser Focus, Iron Defense, Dragon Tail. But can also learn a lot of TMs as well. I have Outrage. It's probably Heavy Slam, honestly. It's probably using Heavy Slam, which is Steel type. And if that's the case, I should swap it out for the Snorlax. I wish I could taunt it so I'd be constantly. Yeah, it's big splash. So it's not heavy slam. That's for sure. Body press. No. It's a fighting type move. It does 80 damage. Apparently. Body press. So I should have switched to the ghost. I should have switched to the sword. We've been fine. A partage. There's a definite disadvantage to playing this when I don't know the language. I didn't know that it was using a fighting type move. Again, if I had, I would have swapped to the sword and then probably swapped to the snow axe. Alright, everyone who's still alive got level. Yeah, you got some money. We're here with the sword! One sword, two sword. Da -da -da -da. All of the things. Oh dear gosh. Yeah, this gift Eevee cannot evolve. <laughs> oh my god. All of that time spent trying to get it. It can't evolve. Well then. All that time trying to get a Sylveon and it turns out we should have just 
try to catch an Eevee. Or catch a Sylveon, for that matter. The Uniform Dragon! Getting all the patches was never the end goal of these Pokemon games, but it is the end goal of this, so I hope you've enjoyed, and I hope that this episode doesn't take too flippin' long to upload, like all of the others. But with that, I say... Adele!